Hi, this is Kathleen McGinley from Heart Rock Healing and welcome to Wednesday Wisdom. We're going to be pulling a card from the Sacred Path Cards deck based on Native teachings and asking, what is it that we need to know at this time and see how we can apply the lesson into our week. All right. Here's our card for this week, the Sundance card, and, and take a look at that. And uh, it doesn't look pretty because it's all about self-sacrifice, but it's a good thing. It's, it's something we really, really, really need to do this week. Um, just a little bit about the Sundance ceremony, if you're not familiar with it. It's this four-day ceremony of dance by warriors who have been chosen uh, to prove their worthiness because when they do this, this Sundance, they are actually sacrificing themselves for the good of all, you know, giving their pain so that others may flourish. And uh, it's, a, it's this four-day ceremony where they get a, uh, a standing person, a tree, that's placed in the center, and then they ask a maho. A maho is a person with two souls, they call it, in one body. And, and that is a, a person who is a female with some male characteristics or a male with some female characteristics and they are chosen to carry the medicine pouch, the Sundance bundle they call it, to the top of the pole where it's placed during this four day ceremony. And, um, and they respect and honor these Mahos because they feel that it's this rare and beautiful gift uh, that they have and they can represent both the men and the women. So after this is all placed, then we have the, um, the warriors who are going to be doing the Sundance who are, have been preparing for this. Um, they have these piercings, as you can see, in the pectoral muscles. So they have these, uh, you know, take these awls, I believe they call them, and, and, and go right through the connective tissue. And, and then thongs are attached to that, which are attached to the stake. So it creates this carousel effect where they dance without food or water for four days. And, and in this whole process, they are, uh, you know, sacrificing themselves. It's, it's this giving of the, the pain so that they can walk in balance and, and basically um, give, give up the, the I, give up the ego for the we, okay? And so this is a week, but by pulling this card, this is a week where we are asked to look at what can we willingly give up so that the sacredness of our lives can be restored. And it's different for different people. You know, maybe it's doubt or fear that you need to look at that are keeping you from attaining your dreams, as an example. Or maybe there's some bad habits or recklessness or overindulgence. Um, so take a look this week at what it is that you need to willingly give up so that you can restore the sacredness of your life. So this is Kathleen McGinley from Heart Rock Healing. Have a great week and I'll check back with you next week for some more Wednesday Wisdom. Take care.